on to the last section covering question number four. The graph below represents another plan that Axel and Inez considered. The x-axis represents the number of terabytes of data from photos that can be uploaded each month, and the y-axis represents the number of terabytes of data from the text files. Identify the x-intercept and the y-intercept, and what do they represent in this context? All right. Well, my x-intercept would be this point right here, which is 180 comma zero. So x-intercept is 180 comma zero. Y-intercept would be right here. Y-intercept is 360 comma zero. Nope, 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 scratch that. Reverse it. It would be zero comma three sixty x comma y. Sorry. Make that zero comma three sixty there. Okay. What does this represent? Well, x, y. Remember, x represents terabytes from photos. And this would be terabytes from text. Okay, so x intercept is 180 terabytes, oops, C-E-R-A-B-Y-T-E-S, from photos, and zero from text. While the y-intercept represents zero terabytes from photos, and 360 terabytes from text. Determine the equation for the boundary line of the graph and justify your response. So what is this equation of the line itself? All right, well, let's see. We got a couple of things we could do here. We could do slope intercept, y equals mx plus b. I can find my B. Remember, that's my y-intercept. And I can find my slope by using my two points here. y2 minus y1 over x2 minus x1. So let's do that. We've got 360 minus 0 over... 0 minus 180. It's going to be 360 over negative 180, which is negative 2 for my slope. And B is that y intercept. So y equals negative 2x plus 360. Slope 
y intercept. Now, is this going to be, when we move into part C, it says model with mathematics, write a linear inequality to represent this solution or this situation, and then describe the plans in your own words. Well, I want to actually write this in standard form. So this currently says y equals negative 2x plus 360, but standard form says ax plus by equals c. So I need to move this x term. So this would say plus 2x on both sides. That would be 2x plus y is equal to 360. That would be the standard form of it. So if I wrote this in inequality form, would the combination of the text files and the photos be greater than 360, less than 360, are we equal to? Okay, so I'm getting 2x plus y must be less than or equal to 360. Let's talk about the reasonings here, or talk about the plan. The text files take one terabyte per file. while the photos take two terabytes and together they must be less than or equal to 360 terabytes. On to the wrap-up of this lesson.